All right. I think all is good. Let's go. Okay. So we're going to the catacombs. He's asleep again. Back to Skelly Land, now that we can kill the Skellies. I really don't like that kick move. It's fairly obnoxious. I'm sure there are uses for it, but... Must be like the dead berg or whatever, right? Perish. Anyways. Yeah, I'm sure these use for the kick like against shields or something. I think it's good, but it does it during combos, which is the weirdest part to me. It's like I'll swing and then swing again, but the second swing is a kick for some reason. I don't know why that's the case. Okay. I don't know why I kicked there. Doesn't make any sense. A uh, yeah, torch still would have been nice for navigating this place. I don't know where you get those. you can use for sources of light. Two light hits, one handed. Oh, oh shit. Oh. Yeah, I came here a lot earlier and it was a nightmare, but now I have a divine weapon, so I have returned. Who's arching me? I don't know where the archer is. Ah, oh, he's up there. I see. Kill these assholes. Ooh. Oh, shit. It's okay, they don't seem to hurt me much either. You, sir. Interesting. How are you doing today, Crow Burp?
Is this the way it came? No. Ow. That's the way it came up. Weird. Okay. There we go. Oh shit, I didn't realize that was a trap, but though. Okay, skeleton. Sure. You want to turn around while we're fighting? I'm okay with that. It's a contraption. There's another one over there. What are we going to do with these? What happens? Boop. Oh. Ooh! That makes the bridges not cancer. Okay, I understand. Cool. Oh my god. Neat. They're actually bridges now. Ow. Okay. Huh. I don't know how the shield did that, but okay. Asshole. Oh god, that's not good. Dang, this guy is dexterous. Mr. Fireball Man. Doesn't seem to understand what's happening. What the hell? What is the point in this? Maybe there's a summon sign here when I'm not bacon. Camera, please. Ow. Oops. Okay. Dang, dude. Ah, shit, I didn't see him. Ah, shit, fuck. Asshole statues. Okay, got that, got that. Looks like something, but I guess it's not. Onward. Ooh, another 
another switch. That'll do something. That looks like a sure death, right? I doubt I can actually jump to that. I think it just kind of slopes out, not actually a platform. That stuff looks pretty far down below. Maybe that one isn't dead if I landed on it, but that's not something I'm going to risk right about now. So let's see, what can we do? Gotta go back. Hit another switch. That opened this up, okay cool. That's here. Another switch to do that bridge. Haha, <laughs> <laughs> I'm a genius. They hide so many bonfires behind bullshit walls. I mean, it's not that bullshit, it's fairly obvious if you're looking for it, but... Still. It's like the second or third hidden one. And then there was one behind the centipede down the demon rooms. That was pretty mean. Another bonfire here. Wonderful. Go up here. There's that other area back there that I can go to. Oh, here's a switch. And that leads to a white fog game. Or a white light or whatever. Not fog gate. Check this way first. Might not lead anywhere. Nope, it doesn't. What is going on out here? What the fuck? Must be up above or something? No idea. Huh. I could jump to there. I want to. Little cavern. I don't know if that's backwards or not. That could be backwards. Does this go away? They just go forever. I'm getting parried by skeletons? Holy. Oh, shit. Guy up there. It's kind of mean. Treasure. Ow. This is his treasure, but I don't know about. 
about that. Jump that. That wouldn't be too hard. Might have to. Nope, I don't. Some asshole statues. Makes me feel like there's something over there. I got to this point before. Which actually, there's a demon coming up. Uh, actually, I'm too heavy now, right? So, drop the shield. I don't think I'll need it. Not very much. Getting stuck on your arm is a problem. Uh. Oops. Ooh, that was bad. took all my estuses remaining. And what was it for? Nothing. Okay. fell down that pit. Oh, that's not a hole. It's this hole is here. There's a silver or black knight down there. Maybe take them now? I'm not happy about not having any Estus right now, though. That's not great. This is where I couldn't get past because bone wheels were catching me and I couldn't see anything. Okay, that's fair. <coughs> Shh. 
sure. Alright, now I gotta figure out how to get back down there again. I think I can just jump. Oh, I can do this now, I guess. Why not? Ow, oh, fuck. That was for that item there, and then I lost it. That was dumb. Oh, shit. That was really dumb. I was trying to jump that, because I panicked at the last second. <laughs> I don't know how many runes I had, but they're gone now. Your souls. I think it was only like 9,000. 9, That's okay. Not a big loss. Okay, let's do this again. And actually do it right this time. There we go. Great side. The weapon I will probably not use. Whoa! Cool. Okay, that's helpful. Already back here, awesome. Oh, that broke the floor there. Huh. How about that? Oh, the wizard stays dead. Cool. Wow. Oh, bonkers. He st goes through my shield because he did a jump attack? Huh. That seems a little weird. Where did he com come from? There's a dark knight down here? So I'm gonna try and do a... No, that doesn't break, okay. Get myself killed there for no reason. Okay. I was lucky that nothing got me there. Alright, this is the furthest I've gotten. I almost made it here, one time. Pass through, that's nice. Why does this look like Lost Isolith? Ah, invisible wall, lame. Oh, is this the witch? I can't believe how close I got to this fight before. Wonder how badly it would have gone. Probably like annihilated or something. We'll see. Pinwheel, okay. Oh, are there three of them? I feel like someone said this fight was like a real big bitch. 
I suppose had it taken longer, it might have been, but... Right of kindling, you may now kindling belong... Bleh, kindle beyond the normal limit. Nice. Yeah, I imagine if I had gotten there earlier when I first went down here, it probably would have been uh, a lot worse. But I don't see that being way too bad. But it could be worse than I think. Uh, am I trapped down here? like wearing headpieces though. Huh. Yeah, it'd be nice to put it on, but I don't like wearing helmets because then it covers up my beautiful face. Uh, so I guess I homeward bone out of here. It did give me one. Slightly annoying. Is there anything else down here? Feels like there should be. I heard that guy blacksmithing. Ladder after the boss. Oh shit, whoops. I did something like that when I came here last time, only from a different spot. So there was no way I was navigating this place like normal. Skeletons, fuck that. Down here. Oh shit, that's pretty far. Oh, okay, it's okay. I don't do much. This room that's a pain. Oops. Is there some way to like, like get up there? These mothers. Okay. Ladder. Oh, I see. It's not like an actual ladder. It's like rungs in the wall. Nice. Thank you for uh, letting me know that. I know what's happening. Hmm? Oh, seems I have no choice. that means by shortcut ahead unless it's referring to the lights oh that's 
scared me. I feel like I really need a torch or something. those. Yeah, it's a lot darker down there. Um, Okay, I'll try and get him back, I guess. <laughs> This stuff is like pretty dark here, but down there was was really, really dark. times is brutal. Okay. Nope, it wasn't safe. It wasn't safe. Oh my god, holy shit. I thought they could mostly only go in straight lines. a bonfire up here. The shortcut ahead makes me think that there's a shortcut this way. Doesn't feel like it's the shortcut I want. So I can't go back that way. No. I'm alive somehow, though. Please don't knock me off. Oh, thank God. <laughs> I am amazed I'm alive. Not for long, though. Man, is that some ominous shit right there.
Should have just homeward bound. Just have to do that this time. Get it, get it out. Oh shit. Oh, wow, that was really close to him sniping me. <laughs> what an asshole. Okay. There's a lot of unavoidable falling damage in this game. Or maybe there is a way to avoid it and I just don't know. These rainbow stones change color every time. died there. So what am I doing here? Oh, okay. That's also not an item to pick up. My souls rip the rune. Guess that leaves me free to go looking for a torch. Um, hmm. Still no new warps. That's kind of lame. Uh. Where do I find a source of light? You don't sell anything, do you? Hey, go do something. Pyromancies? Does that have a way to like... Wait, shit, I didn't hear what he said. Fuck. Uh... 
No. Okay. I think it's a good thing I said no. These don't just float around, I like throw them, so I don't know if that really works. Sleeping. Doesn't this guy have like something he can teach me? I do is use spells, so I'll need a talisman. Isn't there someone else somewhere around here? Right here. Oh, hello. Terrific to see and pray that you never go. Oh, no, you don't have anything. Uh, I don't think the lady at the end of this hallway has anything, but she could. Grabbing a few transient curses, and so I'll probably have to go back to New Londo at some point. Let's see what kind of souls do I have. Oops. Be enough to buy something. Okay, so. buy two of them, but they're 4,000. I guess she only has one. Dang, it's all of her curses. That's not good. Guy down in the sewers. Ooh. I think did something. I don't remember. <laughs> guy up here, I think. No, I think there's the guy up with the gargoyles. That's what I'm thinking. <coughs> I suppose I could talk to Andre and see what he has to say. I'll 
Check up here first, though, I suppose. Ah, I suppose. Though I could, like, go to the bonfire over at Andre and then come back and then bone back, but whatever. Let's go. Let me through. Do you have a light spell or something? Karmic justice? Temporary auto casts counter versus heavy damage. Kill and a half. What's up here again? Oh, this is where the pyromancer was, I think. He just dropped in the barrel. Just the guy afraid who killed my firekeeper. Probably. I thought that was down the depths. Maybe. Maybe that's a different guy. Let's go see what Andre's up to, I guess. Slayer, but he's unfortunately dead. I had to put him down. I actually remember what's down this path. I know I had to go this way at some point. Oh, Sun's Fortress, right? Yeah, fuck that. I'm not going back here. Um, 
was I just thinking of? There's something I just had a thought about. just thinking of, I just had a thought and now it's gone and it's driving me crazy. Yeah, this is for the hell of it. I'll check the dark root and see if that door activates now. Maybe I got something and I didn't know or maybe doing the load vessel thing unsealed it. I don't know. But I'm not going to rest at any fires in between so I can bone back run through. Have I ever gone this way? Yeah, there's just nothing over here. I like that item. I don't know how I get it to it though. Still locked by some contraption. Um, let's come from that way at some point, I guess. Masterful spacing. Can I get both of them? Wow. Okay. Dude. What the fuck? Are you kidding me? How'd I miss? Give me the item. Wow, that was a nightmare. For no reason. How do I get up like there? That looks like there's an area up there. Not really though, it's just a ledge, never mind. leads up here.
I don't think does me any good. Unless there's some like door in here that I don't know about. Doesn't leave me anywhere. Looks like Andre. I wonder if it is the statue of him. Kind of looks like a petrified person. I can't really tell. Yeah, I don't know how to get to those areas, so I guess it's just bone time. I suppose. I'll go check him out. And I guess the last NPC I know I can buy from is... I don't think I saw an item glow over here. Oh, there he is. The last person I know to talk to is... In New Londo, that's who. Hey, Art Dev, I've been good. How are you doing? Just trying to figure out where to get a source of light because I cannot see anything in the catacombs of the giants. Checking all my NPCs that I know about. Ooh, nice. Now, by second boss, what do you mean? Because second boss could mean a few things. Do not have a skull lantern that I know of. have this alluring skull, but I don't think that's a skull lantern. Uh. Lady Butterfly, okay, yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's a different second boss than some other people are gonna run into. Sunlight talisman. I don't know if that creates any light. Yeah. Skull lantern. Is that an easier to find source of light than most? I know there's a spell, but I don't know who teaches it or where it is. Yeah, it's sad, the sunlight maggot. Oh, the skull lantern is a helmet? Or no, you're saying sunlight maggot. Does that actually give light? Travel back in time, let my father die in a fire, th fire then kill a fat drunk dude and hallucinate, hallucinate to find his boss. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> Sekiro gets pretty weird. One on the head it emanates. 
creates blinding light. But you can't, can you take it off once you put it on? Doesn't say as much, but... for a period of time, just not permanently. No. Do you know if the helmet stays on permanently? Why can't I do this? There we go. see anything saying that it stays on. Let's test it. That's pretty cool though. Okay, cool. I can take it on now. Great. It doesn't even make me heavy roll. Fantastic. <laughs> just put it on. Oh well. Uh, it's just if you go the other path, uh, your far your first boss would have been someone different if you didn't go to Verada. Or wait. Yeah, yeah, second boss, you're saying is lady, which means you fought Jizo before that. And if you hadn't gone to Arata, there's a different boss that you could run into. And I do not mean Ganach Genichiro. Genichiro is like... One, two, maybe fourth. Oh, you're not counting Jizoa as a boss. Okay. Then you did fight Gyobu. Uh, am I going? No, I'm so stuck in my ways before. I went the wrong way. <laughs> No, not that. Uh, I was thinking um, Gyobu can be your first boss, but I guess you're counting him as first boss anyways, because you're not counting Jizo the Drunkard. Which I'm not really sure why you're not counting him, but that's fine. Um, and then the next boss, I guess, would be the Bull. But if it's your first playthrough, I don't want to say too much, you know? 
If you're not counting Giselle, I don't know if you'd count the bull. Or even the other guy. So maybe Genichiro would technically be the second boss by your judging. Because I count Giselle. Jizuo or whatever. Some killing shinobi. Ah, okay, I see. Yeah. Well then, yeah, I guess Genichiro would be second. Would be the alternate second. Yeah, that's fair. I think that's probably how uh, FromSoft judges it too. Based on something Miyazaki recently said, makes me think that we have not seen many bosses for the um, DLC, and Mesmer might be the only boss that we've actually seen that's in the DLC. And we may not have seen any of the others yet. So I kind of would have thought that the lion was a boss, but I'm not sure it is. I think it might just be a mini boss. Oh shit, that was a kind of shitting one. Nope, that's good. Yeah, I'm hoping to get some money soon so I can uh, pre order that. I'm not actually sure when that's gonna come through yet. I think it's a mini boss, I don't think it's a proper boss. Based on what Miyazaki has been saying in interviews, I could be wrong. But I don't think the Wicker Man or the Lion are bosses. Wicker Man is definitely like an overworld mini boss thing, like Tree Sentinel. It's like almost guaranteed, I'd say. I like the Tree Sentinel and the Grave, anyways. Lion might be a boss, though, but just based on something Miyazaki said, it makes me think it's not. Yeah, I know. I know. But would you count... Oh my god, dude. Holy shit, these wheels are a nightmare. Uh, the flaming wicker giant thing. With all the dead bodies in it. Um, would you count Land Sax as a boss? The white dragon in Landau. Let you fight twice. Okay. Criteria for Sekiro and Elden Ring seem to be quite different then. So I would assume that remembrances are what make a real boss in Elden Ring. Ow. Ow. How am I so low on health already? Jesus. Fortnite balls. Uh, I don't know why you're saying that, but that's okay. Welcome to the stream. Things are a nightmare. 
fucking hell. Okay, they can make 90 turns. I didn't realize that. I'm dead. Oh, I hate these wheels. Holy shit. Some pretty simple bosses in Elden Ring that have health bars, so I don't know, man. Yeah, I I can agree with uh, with um, I don't know with your with your shinobi executions and stuff. I think that's fair and reasonable. I think it's fair to count all Elden Ring bosses with health as bosses, and I'm not here to judge about that. It's just based on what Miyazaki said about bosses in one of the interviews that makes me think that it's not a full-on boss. And that it's more like, uh... I mean, Misbegotten Leonine in Castle Morn is kind of like an enemy turned into a boss, and I'm not saying that the lion will be like that, but I think it's more like that. It's like a boss. Probably have an area, but I don't think I'll give a memory or anything like that. Oh my god, dude. Holy shit, these things are overpowered. Dude, no! Holy fuck! God damn! Fuck these things! How'd I get past them so many times without a problem? Someone asked if the lion was a boss or something, and he said you could think of it as a boss or something like that. That's really the only reason why I'm not sure. No, that was really close. Holy shit. Man, I need a firekeeper soul. Fuck. That might be another thing, is that he just means it isn't mandatory, and it could just be in an area. And not even an open field boss, but just like in a castle or something. But not like a mandatory castle or whatever or maybe it's like a halfway boss in a legacy dungeon or like Margit, it, it could be like Margit where he's guarding a legacy dungeon I wonder if the skeletons have better aim because I have a light over my head Dude, holy shit. Like, what the fuck? What is with them? It's gotta be the light. They were not that aggressive before. They didn't come down here. Yeah, we'll see. I don't know if I would call it disappointing just because I'm going to do everything in it anyways. I like the optional stuff. I like when really cool bosses are optional. Well, this is like mildly better. Still pretty sketchy. I hate that that just goes clean through my shield. Oh no. Uh, okay. <laughs> sure, I don't know how I lived through that, but yeah. 
Oh, shit. No, couldn't have known that was gonna happen. I don't think he even uses blood flame though, I think it's something new. Yeah, Patches strikes again. I knew it was coming as soon as I saw the rainbow stones back up there. They tried to, oh there's the skull lantern. They tried to trick me into thinking that they were there to help me. Because for a little bit I was kind of thinking that, but it was just like, nah, it's definitely Patches. He's gonna push me off a cliff, 100%. Whoa. Uh oh. Who are you people? Oh shit. Ah, uh, healing sucks. Damn, that's good health. Fuck you. Oh, these are those people. I thought I didn't hit that lady on accident. These guys are a pain. Fuck. This guy takes like no damage. What the fuck? Okay, there we go. That's how you do damage. I recognized his voice but didn't uh, know well enough at the time when I played Dark Souls 3. It's like, you sound like someone else. Those two hollows, did you? Oh, yeah. It me to think of the trouble my failings have caused. They tried to I'm kill me. I'm certain that both Vince and Nico are grateful to you. Thank you so very much. Here, these belonged to them. You deserve them more than I. Okay, thanks, I'm I guess. That, thank you. Do you need help out of here? Alright man, thanks for stopping by. See you uh, another time. because body blocking this game is overpowered. No, come this way. Don't go don't be so central. Please. Oh, there's no way I'm getting past two of them. 
And they're coming from behind now. This is really bad. Dude, come on. Please. Spacing is so bad. I'm dead. Dude, fuck these things. This is fucking gay. That is retarded. Anything that just stands in your way that's annoying like that, I hate it. They don't even do anything, they just body block you, that's it. Okay. This place is starting to grind at me. Oh my god. Figured out how to get that item. <sighs> Please, dude, come on. So annoying. Patches, kind of. He kicked me off the edge, uh, but I didn't see any bonfires. like shit enemy in all of Dark Souls. Oh, what? Oh no, I need to jump down and then roll off. I'm an idiot. That was my bad. I thought I already hit the right spot. <sighs> this place. If they didn't deal damage like every single frame that they're touching you, it would be fine. But they they deal damage too often. It's like the fucking Scarlet Rot Dogs before they were patched. Uh, I think if I take off the hat, it'll help them not see me. I think. Taking the helmet off helps for getting past them. Oops. They're drawn to the light. What, the sunlight maggot helm? Really? Huh. I guess actually it is in a pretty weird place.
And most people are going to go do the Bed of Chaos, and then after beating Bed of Chaos, just peace out and not go back. And miss the side path that leads to it. I have no idea how to get back down here, though, because I accidentally fell down an area. Oh, no, this is it. Dude, I had my shield in front of that. That's garbage. Oh. Oh shit, I thought the white light was gonna stay up so that that thing couldn't follow me. Welcome to the stream. I'm not sure how to say your name. Apologies. Sonasakaulis? I'll just call you JJ. Hello, JJ. Welcome to the stream. What does your name mean? I'm guessing it has a meaning, anyways. My day has been alright. The catacombs of the giants have soured it a little bit, but you, know, you gotta you gotta take the pain when it comes to Dark Souls. I national name I see. Uh, this is right. Yeah, it's just down here. How have you been today? Shit. I almost feel like they do more damage when I'm wearing that sunlight helm too, but that's probably just my imagination. are insane. They do way too much damage too quickly. Per hit, it's not too bad. It's just that they can hit you like 20 times in like 5 seconds. Or in like 1 second round. <laughs> um, let's go. Keep on going. I'm going. Uh, is that a friendly? Oh, that's patches. I don't understand why my shield doesn't work against these big guys. Um, I'm probably not gonna play Dark Souls 2. Three and I'm not against restreaming it, or not restreaming it, replaying it for the stream. So I probably will. I don't know if that'll be next or not. I was kind of thinking Sekiro, but I'm not sure about that either. But uh, oh, actually, I should probably like actually rest here and stuff, <laughs> like Kindle. Humanities. Do, 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 do. 
Three could be a good next stream, though. It'd be a good contrast for me. Let's see just how wildly different the two are. So I've definitely been feeling the age of this game. As much as I've enjoyed this game, there's been a lot of frustration, which is why I don't think I'll play DS2, because if I'm having that much trouble with this game, I feel like I'm really not going to like DS2. I... Well, let's just calm down. Talk about things. I did you wrong, but I didn't mean it. Yes, you did. Temptations. They can, well, overcome me. You know what I mean, don't you? Please, forgive me. You and me, we're jolly undead outcasts, aren't we? Fine. Oh, brilliant. A second chance. Wonderful. I had a feeling you'd understand. I know you don't deserve it, but... but uh, if I were in your shoes... <laughs> Who knows what I'd have yeah, you wouldn't have forgiven me. Now we're friends again. Again? <laughs> we were friends before? I don't even know who you are, man. It's over here. Not a firekeeper soul, that's for sure. Oh, fuck off. Go, go, go. Dude, let me past you, fuck's sake. I hate getting body blocked in this game. And we're dead. Dude, I would have lived, but he landed on top of me. Oh my god. Thank goodness for this bonfire. Thank you for telling me about it. I probably would have missed it. Imagine going from DS3 to this would be way more painful. <laughs> I did play Elden Ring not too long before this, though. So there have been some very clear uh, moments of... Wow, the quality has really improved over the years. <laughs> Pretty much everything I don't like about this game has to do with its jank, like the old jank. It'd be fine, I'm sure. Okay, we're good, we're good, we're good. Eat. Drink. No! Okay, that's not death. Where the heck am I going? Oh, bubba. Like, the game's pretty good on its own, and it's actually really good for its time, I'd say. But it has a ton of jank from its age, you know. It's it's a really ambitious game. It's trying to do a lot, and uh, the things it's trying to do are not easy for its time. Ooh, Crystal Lizard. Lizard. 
missed somehow. Uh, what? Hmm, maybe I should follow the outside path. Could be a bonfire. Could be one down there, though. It's definitely not a bonfire. Oh, he finally died. He fell through the floor and died. Okay. I was worried I wasn't going to get that because it phased out of existence at the same time as me hitting it or something. But I did get it. Alright. We're definitely going this way then. Don't have a choice. Oh, no. Not these guys. God damn it. No, I'm going to have to kill this one, aren't I? Can I get around it? Oh, it went away. Weird. Okay. Oh, looks like there's a shortcut through there. If I jumped. Oh, shit. Bin wheels. A whole bunch of them. Firekeeper souls. Go. Oh, I need one. Please. No, don't lock on to the little skeletons. Stupid game. There's a pinwheel right there. You know what I really want to lock on to. Don't give me that. Don't even die. Ah, uh, there's an item over there I didn't get. Shoot. Let's go get it. Get it, get it. Soul of a hero. Not of a zero. this? Is this actually anything? Firekeeper soul? No. White Titanite slab. Ooh. Woo. Alright. Into the white light. Gorilla's song that I keep thinking of. Mm. Now that looks like some bacon. Okay, into this hole. The white slabs? Mm. I thought it was green that I used divine for, but. Uh oh, is this Nito? Nito!
That's neato, all right. And I'm at like half health. Wonderful. Uh, there are skeletons in here with him. That's bad. I'm not too uh, pleased with that. Dude, come on, let me attack. Huh? Yeah? No? No, it's divine. I should probably keep my divine weapon. Damn. Oh shit, I can't block him at all, I guess. Bring the skeletons back to life. No, he's just exploding. I was gonna put on my other sword. Uh, bad time, I guess. I didn't know. Uh, brutal. I don't like losing half my health just dropping down there, though. It's kind of annoying. Fuck off, really? This place is incredibly sketchy. Keeper solo. Oh god damn. Can you guys stop following me, please? Some skeletons down there that I want to kill before I switch. Yeah, that time I didn't lose. Oh, yeah, I did. Never mind. There's all my health gone. Oh, shit. Uh, that's fair, sure. Excuse me?
These let me switch weapons? What the hell was that? That was weird. Okay, good. I can actually hurt him with this. But there's also a skeleton here. Which means I'm gonna have to switch back. Oh yeah, also that makes me heavy. Good. He's gonna do that. Nice. It's gonna explode. Heal. It's gonna explode again. No, okay. Shit, I'm out of Estus. That's not good. Exploding, that's bad. Okay, I got away. Nice. Nice. Hello, attack, please. Whew. Uh, hello? Okay. I can't loot that, I guess. Yeah, first try. Here, second try? Died first try. Yeah, second try. Not bad. Alright, let's get the holy weapon back on. <laughs> Not too bad. I could see that being a heck of a lot worse, though. The, uh... Knight's Black Sword was pretty good. Alrighty. What do we want? Decently strong, but let's get an extra strength. More health would be good. And endurance. Uh, so I need 10,000-ish more. I'll use some souls. Let's see. Let's try three of these. Yeah, that's enough. I'll get a little more health. Nice. Now, are there any hidden ladders here. I feel like this is the end, because Nito. Makes uh, sense to be the end. Alright. Tomb of the Giants fucking warp. Well. Um hmm. Hum and um. Hmm. 
Now where do I go? Oops. Guess I lost that. Oops. Oh no, there it is. I could go back to New Londo, I guess. There's definitely got to be more there to do, right? like this, the uh, hat doesn't really do a whole lot now, does it? What the hell? Who are you? Oh, it's you. Oh, goodbye. <laughs> I could have talked to Fatty Bin Ding Dongs back at uh, Firelink. I don't get anything for killing him. Maybe his loot just needs to reload. I don't have any curses, which is unfortunate. No, I have one. I have one uh, transient curse, so I can actually do that. Kill ghosts if need be. What? Okay. Man, I really need a fire keeper, so what the heck? Probably would be better though, to be honest. Wow. Oh, cool. How did I get stuck on that? Excuse me? What was I stuck on? Well, there goes my last transient curse. And I'm back at the two month check. <laughs> also, there's a better warp point to go to, I think. And this isn't doing me much good, so put me over. Yes, it does. Solaire's armor is too fat. But I take off the gloves and be good. Okay, uh, I think the fastest way to set it up is still to go this way, though. Good <laughs> out here. Um. through Valley of the Drakes. And there 
there's a cave somewhere around there. Here's the way to Dark Root Basin. Has fire. The leads down to Drake's. The Valley of Drake's. And then the Valley of Drake's leads to New Londo. Or Lower New Londo, or whatever. So I'll do that. So this way is kind of a pain in the ass. Going through the ghosts. I still don't think I can deal with this guy, or I don't really want to. I probably could, but he kills me so fast. It didn't take three Estes to heal up. What if I use a bow? That's worth it. Onward. It's like yeah, we go. All right. <sighs> these Dargons. And up here is the lift. Oh, use the thing. Right up here, right there. All right. Now we can get a new Londo quick.
These guys are way too on the ball with their shields. I missed! What do you mean I missed? He's like a pixel away. Insane. Well then, that didn't work. I tried to be preemptive. this direction anyways. This just leads to the well to Artorius or something. And I can't go down there yet. So I don't really know what to do anymore. Uh, hmm. What's this way? See, it's here. Is this where the Hydra was, I think? there's anything here to do oh looks like there's something way over there couldn't really tell though oops they didn't place the rock close enough to the ground I don't know where the water ends here. Whoa. Apparently just got 62 new messages. Now I'm gonna get body blocked by golems. I'm dead. Oh, I made it out somehow. Okay. Nope. That takes too long. I can just one shot them. Cool. What was that, a pixel away? Can I go over there? It's like a light. I don't know what it is. Wait, where did you come from?
can't see the ground. This is a noise. Oh, I found something. Cool. There was something beyond the waters. I was just too scared to walk across the water. Trapped in a dream, snake eater. Chinese fireball. This looks like a spot in the shadow of the Colossus. And a ladder. Okay. I hope this isn't just some interconnectivity stuff and this actually leads somewhere. I have a feeling it's interconnected, though. Dark Root Garden. Where, though? Where is this in the garden? This must be a different part of the garden. Go the other way real quick. Cross the zip bridge. Don't kill, please. Whoa, they have a lot of health! Where'd the tree pull go? I want him dead first. Holy snakes! This. Oh, oh, oh. No, the tree fucked me. I should have killed the tree. Uh. If I cheese the dog right, I can hit him with the heavy attack. That, though. There we go. Damn, dude, the fucking spacing in this game. It's tough. Oh shit, I'm out. Good. Give me Estus for killing him. Why isn't this Elden Ring? There's another one. Oh god, there's two more. Are you kidding me? Just cheese him right here and it's all good. What? What do you mean? Why do they do that? They go running over there like psychos. Wow. 
Only 2k for those two. Weak. And it was 5k for the blobs that can barely move down the sewers, alright. Or wherever that was with the giant blobs. Okay. Starting to think about that other direction now. I didn't think both of them would be so expansive. Thought one way would be like the right way and the other one would be like here's some loot or something. something over there. Mushroom people. Oh, white fog gate. Ooh. I feel like looking around a bit more though. Gotta be some cool stuff out here, right? This giant forest. Okay, here's something. Is this going to take me to the door? Damn. That was a bad idea. This is not good. Okay. We're fine. I hope this takes me to the other side of that gate so that I can get a bonfire. That'd be nice. Oh. Is it not so that Hello. Thou fared well to find me, that cometh thee not for the grave of Sir Artorius. My advice true. Forget this. The legend of Artorius are none but a fabric. Liar. Traversing the dark. Is but a fairy tale. Fire. Go not yonder knocking for nothing, I say. <sighs> uh, I don't. What? No. The result most heathenish and gross. When there is nothing more to say about this tedious wreck thing. Oh. Begun. So, well, I guess I answered wrong. Is this just the other side? Could I have just gone over here before? another person coming and there's someone arching me okay yeah I could have come up this way before so what's that path interesting You really go for a bonfire though, that'd be nice. Uh, 
item over there. Oh my god, dude. Fuck off. Uh, where even am I? I don't know where my last fire is. Interconnectivity, yeah, yeah, yeah. Who needs bonfires when everything's connected? Definitely doesn't make people get frustrated when they die, because they have to run all the way back to the last spot they were at. There are no bonfires anywhere. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, fun time. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. climbing ladders for a minute. Woohoo! Interconnectivity. So winter That makes it better than Dark Souls 3 or Elden Ring, because it's interconnected. More bonfires don't make things more fun, interconnectivity does. Because this is fun. Climbing ladders is just a blast. Woohoo. That was exciting. Can't wait to do that again once I die. that can hit you from like a fucking mile away is really cool! Now oh, I think I'm dead if I try to heal. Let's try. Okay, I made it. I was able to heal. Can I do it again? Hell yeah. Over here, some lights and stuff. Nothing. I think my next task is to go to that white gate that I didn't go to before. use it. Yep. Couldn't attack. I'm not allowed to attack them. <sighs> Too slow. Yay. I can't wait to make the run back again because there are no fucking bonfires anywhere. Climbing ladders. Yes. I love when there aren't bonfires. Because the world is so well interconnected that they don't need them. How do 
I feel like I'm running slower than usual? Weird how my computer sometimes just doesn't update. It says that I've only been streaming for 45 minutes. That's not true. Okay. What the fuck is happening? Right. I'm going to switch to my Claymore. Yeah, yeah so we handers too slow. I don't need a fast weapon. That's my problem right now. Yeah, so I go over here. Up this hill. Kill this guy. Uh, he has a lot of health, I guess. And he can poise through everything I do and their trees. Okay, dude. Never mind, I'm not fighting them. Fuck that. Takes like zero damage. And trees come out of nowhere, and then archers come out of nowhere, and I have to climb up ladders for ten minutes again. Woohoo! Yeah, interconnectivity! Woo! Yeah, so much fun! Yeah, woo! Who needs bonfires? Bonfires are for pussies. Probably some bonfire hidden behind like a secret wall around there or something. Behind a secret tree. Like off some ledge that I have to jump off of in a sketchy place. So they don't want you to find bonfires for some reason. I don't know why they hide them so much. Like, it'd be neat if they hid ones that were, like, uh, halfway points or something. But <laughs> some of them are, like, crucial bonfires and they're hidden. I don't know why they do that. I just don't want people to have fun. I don't want you spending more of your time running around, I guess. Really feel this game's age. I think I'm gonna go over here and just go through the fog gate. Do I have to kill the cats again? Probably. Nope, they stay dead. Okay. Where was that white fog gate? Over yeah, over there. Oh, yeah. No bonfire around here? No. 
really like one, because this could be a boss fight. Maybe not, though. This door looks weird. Probably can't go here. Switch to my big sword. Well, I think I know who I'm about to fight. Feet lover is gonna miss it. He wanted me to go here. questioning about switching weapons there. I might want to use my claymore after all, because if it's going to be fast, right? Jeez. Okay, cool camera, guys. Hornet thing. That's close. Guess I asked G. in this game are insane. Every attack that knocks you down has like a roll catch attack afterwards. Like you can't get up with a roll. You will die. Oh my god, and I have to run back again for fuck's sake. Uh, I just want to fight the boss again, not run a marathon. doing the thing that I don't like to do, but I, I'm looking up where the bonfire is. So fucking stupid. Dead Berg. Leaving me with a three minute walk. Jeez. Yeah, but I don't have that door open. Uh, what? I don't have the crest of Artorias. I thought that's like why I need to fight Sif. <laughs> Alright, this is the closest one, I guess, because I don't have that door open. I don't think I have the crest of Artorias, anyways. sure it would be in here. <sighs> and I don't know where you get that. Maybe from that cat that I answered the wrong question to? I don't know. This game does not like the average ga uh, player. 
It only likes people who have beaten it already. And not just beaten it, but like fully explored everything. If you don't know where everything is in this game, it is a fucking nightmare. Like, if I knew where the crest of Artorius was, I could have that door open, and then things would be less annoying, but... You have to either get lucky and just get it, or... know that it's there and get it. Someone like me, though, I just don't have it. So I don't get to use that door, unless the game becomes multitudes more frustrating. Just for something that I can't control. Something that I have no say in. And I feel like that's happened a lot for me. Like things could have been a lot easier or more manageable, but because I took a certain path and played the game a certain way, I get punished and have a more frustrating time. Which is really not ideal. Which is something I hear people complain about in Elden Ring. They're like, oh, you're forced into doing it a certain way. But I, I've never had that problem with Elden Ring. I've played that game however I wanted to every time I've played it. I've never been rigid on what I do. This feels like there's a kind of specific way to play the game properly. I missed? Okay. Oops. Damn, that's a weird one to dodge, I guess. I'll get away with it, yeah. How did I miss? Oh, that came out really fast. Okay. Covenant of Artorias. That's what I need to go through New Londo, I believe. Is this a dead end, or is there somewhere else I can go? Doesn't look like there's anywhere to go. Back across to the other side now, I guess. Back to New Londo after I've explored the rest of this area. Too bad they don't have a bonfire in the boss room. Maybe I can talk to him again now and give him the other answer. They got me. Nope. He hates me forever now. How do you backstab people in this game? Oh, 
wish that move had like a lot of poise. I guess it would be a little bit unfair. Hello, what? Okay. Crazy poise to be able to take that move and not fall over or anything. of our Torgus, maybe? Covenant, or whatever. Oop. It's a heavy ring. Oh, right, no, it's because Havel's ring is good. Uh, I don't know how you get through there. Just homeward moan. Go back to New Londo. trees coming from. like walked into the trigger spot for trees I guess Not much out here. That still hit me. How do you dodge that? Are you kidding me? Gonna homeward moan. I don't have any heals left. Wait, why does it say I have one? Because it's saying I have an Estus flask. 
Not like an actual flask, but like the thing. Anyways. Guess it's back to New Londo and down the well. Oh shit. That was where I wanted to actually be. Fuck. That's a faster way down. Uh, I can still Homeward Bone, right? I think that works, because I didn't rest at this one. <sighs> cool. I love body blocking in this game, yes! I wish these assholes were de -aggro. back. Oh, I never killed that one, I don't think, actually. Ah, oh, right here. I almost fell off the edge. And now, just to be safe, I'll go to the bottom, because I'm not sure exactly how you're supposed to do this, or if it matters. Maybe the cat will be my friend after I go down here. Okay. I'm gonna jump off here because it seems more ceremonial. Maybe it matters. Whee! Do I need to keep the ring on? Uh oh. Oh. Not sure if I can take the ring off or not. Looking for. 
needs to be equipped the entire fight. Oh boy. Well, that's not good. Um, I need that equip load to be down, and I don't think this is going to do great damage to them. Try going shieldless? Nope. That's not enough either. What about naked? It'd be totally naked. Okay. That's not ideal, but. give you two ring slots. That's brutal. I have ten fingers. Or at least eight. I know not everybody counts thumbs, but... I'm guessing I can just drop off. What are the odds? What are the odds? What are the odds of that? Come on, dude. Seriously? I just want to fight them again. Why does this game be like this? Not only have runbacks gotten shorter, but they're also less fucking deadly now. It's really nice that you can just run back to the boss without worrying about dying getting there. But Elden Ring is bad compared to Dark Souls 1 because of reasons, I guess. Understand the people who say that Elden Ring is bad while praising Dark Souls. I don't know how you can do that. Oh. Fuck you. Your bullshit stabs. God damn. The tracking and distance on that stab is so fucking balls. <sighs> the aids I get from playing this game from time to time is just insane. It just doesn't want me to enjoy it. It's like, oh, you're having fun? Let me stop you right there. No 
funnel out here. And of course, sometimes the enemies just basically ignore you and they're not a problem at all. I don't know really what dictates any of that, but you know, whatever. I'm not even sure how that guy saw me, considering how dark it is, but... Can't dodge that stab worth fucking piss, because it has such a massive delay and then fucking perfect tracking on it. I tried so hard. And it just doesn't work. Looks like we're going all the way down because jumping off is apparently dangerous. You'll catch on to the side things that are poking out, even though that shouldn't fucking happen, but whatever. Let's see, maybe you can walk off this one without catching any of the others. Nope. Cool waste of another fucking flask. More waste of time running down this shitty hole. I love how much wasted time there is in this game. It's great. Okay. Smashing roll. <sighs> Man, uh, do I have any things? Yeah, a few shards. Two twinkling titan, I could upgrade this again. I need five shards, which I have. Can level that up twice. I don't have any green titan I need shards. I'm just going to use them all and level up. Try to use this Wii Hander for this. Cause this is going to be too slow, I think. Even though this Wii Hander is much faster. again. does this give me? The both. 16, okay. Oops. Two of these. Perfect. Uh, D4. 
do a little more endurance. I don't know if I'll get another level out of these, but it's possible. Let's see. Oop, yep, that's far more than enough. Maybe I can even get two levels if I use all these. Up to 50. Mm, nope, I'm gonna be shy, that's bad. Oh well. Get one more endurance. <sighs> can I upgrade anything else? Dragon scale. White titanate for a cult, yeah. Nothing else to do. Uh, might as well. I wish there was like an all, just repair all. K, but I don't have an easy way to get 7,000. Uh, whatever, who cares? Turn the wrong way there. Oh, I might actually be able to equip some stuff now. I think got my endurance up a bit more. Wow, cool hitboxes game. Amazing. That's just spectacular. Dark Souls 2 hitboxes are bad. It's really hard to not scoff at the people who praise this game. Mainly because instead of praising what's good about the game, they say that all the other games are shit in comparison, which... Sorry can't say that about this game. This game is not better than Dark Souls 3. It's not better than Elden Ring. You could like it more, that's fine. It's not better than them though. Stab is so fucking hard to avoid, holy shit. But apparently a delayed attacks didn't exist until Margit. Because Margit is a cheap delay and attack asshole according to Dark Souls 1 fan base. A shield now, which is kind of cool. I need to waste an Estus. It's like guy's stab is fucked. Run all the way down the stairs because it's not safe to just jump off for whatever reason. They make you run down the stairs. Mm. 
king doesn't show up for a while, so you just stand here for a bit. Okay, I couldn't really tell where that projectile was. Okay. are not very kind. Really long delays and then no delays. It's fair. Definitely fun to fight an attack where he delays massively but then the next follow-up attack is quite fast but just off time where if you roll away from the first attack you get hit. These run backs really ruined the game for me. Because if it's not, like, bummer enough that I die, they have to rub it in by making me run back through all this garbage. Oh my god, that stab is so fucked. Holy shit, I did it. Ghost tried to body block me off the cliff, even though it barely ever comes out that far. This will be where the king appears, maybe? Kind of. Okay. Alright. I hate how they do these long ass wind ups and then their attacks just come out instantaneously and there's no time to react. At least it feels like there's not. I don't know how you dodge that because there's no depth perception. I don't know if I've even hit this boss yet at all. supposed to do it safely. Boy, it sure is fun running back to this boss and then dying in one second and then having to run back again. This is just such a fun experience. Why'd they only get this right with Ornstein and Smell? They had a good run back. It wasn't a fucking mile of running. There was a pretty cool little shortcut you could do where you wouldn't have to fight any enemies or run by any enemies. It wasn't long even if you took the full way. so many of these have like a full minute or longer run backs like who how did the playtesters find this fun 
Did they play test running back or did they just load themselves back at the boss and call it good? I don't know how any playtester does these runbacks and doesn't say anything. Like, hey, maybe we should add a closer bonfire. Or maybe we should change the enemy placement so that they aren't, like, the most annoying thing on the planet. And don't hit you on your way to the boss so that you have to waste flasks getting to the boss. And just anything like that. I don't know how you don't think of these things. Can't tell where that is in relationship to me. I don't even know what just happened. That's still floating around. It grabbed me again, I guess. I don't know how you're supposed to tell what's happening. It just seemed like it was going to attack me again, but it didn't. I don't understand this boss. I don't know how you're supposed to ever heal against it. Because once you're close, you can't really get away. Its range is too much. I don't understand how to avoid that guy. I waited so long to dodge and he still hit me. And I want a flask down as well as some health out of me. Cool as fuck, yeah boy. Didn't do a whole lot of damage to the king when I hit him, so I don't think I really want to switch weapons. I don't think Zui Hander is going to be faster. And Claymore is going to do like 90 damage or something. I'd imagine. I guess I could try it. Why not? Yeah, 65 damage, that's not good. It seems the strat is just circle and strafe. Oh, he grabbed me, never mind. <coughs> I'm not sure how I'm ever supposed to heal now, though. 
Okay. Got one. Uh, what's happening? Okay. Got to heal again. Three of them. Okay. Yeah. Sure. It's not like armor really matters that much, but let's see if I can put any on. God, uh, combo body block stab is ugh. makes me want to puke. His dodge is impossible to dodge, or his attack is impossible to dodge. I don't know why, but there's no way to dodge his attack. He does something weird there where his movement is just un unavoidable. I don't know how he does it, but I, I can't, I can't avoid it. That's two flasks down. Probably three, actually. I don't even know if the third one will full heal me. Okay, three down. Did get a full heal off of it, but that's still three Estus down. Cool, wonderful. A fun fucking place. I missed twice. I don't know how I missed. Oh my god. Hey, feet. It's all good. You did miss Sif though, which I was sad for you to miss Sif. Uh-oh. Ah, dang. That's too bad. Oh, what? That was the grab. Fuck. Looks like you got the thing that we all got before. Me and Hater.
Hey, one king down. Oh, wow, that didn't hit me somehow. Okay. How did I miss? I don't get how I'm missing. Ow. I don't know what to do about those. I shouldn't have rolled. That was close. Don't know how to dodge those, because I can't tell where they are. Somehow, <sighs> can't say I cried too much. so much better if I could just go back to the boss and fight it again. This is already going to be hard enough to do the boss, and they're just making it so much worse. I hate it. I hate it so much. Almost got pushed into the lightning. Still hit me even though I put up my shield. That's his stab in particular. I don't know why it's more powerful than all the others. Wow, and he caught up with me again to do it again. That's three or four Estus down. Wonderful. And I love these runbacks, they're so cool. Estus, because I could have another one, but I'm not going to. the strafing before, but I guess I can't anymore. Cool lock-on, dude. Oh, I can't lock-on from that far away, apparently. 
even though I can't really tell how far away I am because there's no depth perception in here. I can't. Gene and Smo, only it's even less fun. And the run back is more cancers. is AIDS. Reason why the Ornstein and Smell Bonfire was much, much better. Even if you got hurt, you could go back to it quite quickly. This one, if you get hurt on the way, the way back is a lift. At the very least. Otherwise, it's basically not worth going back because it takes so fucking long. standing up there for. close to landing on the stairs and getting hurt. supposed to do about those.
tried really hard, but I don't know how you avoid that. Dodging the discs got me killed. That's cool. Good mechanic. This fight. I have to kill that first king before any other kings show up, and then kill the second king before any other kings show up. And continue that way, but I don't I can't do that kind of damage. And their windows are not there. I guess I'll try this Wii Hander, because it seems to have better staggering power than this thing. But we'll see. Why it has better staggering power, I can tell you. The Black Knight Sword is much larger. This game. People have no right to say anything bad about Elden Ring that like Dark Souls 1. If you like Dark Souls 1, shut up about Elden Ring. You don't know what you're talking about. So even if you avoid that, you still don't avoid it. That's fucking amazing, dude. Fuck this fight. Fuck that attack. No, that doesn't stagger. It's not really much point using this. It's not really any faster. Oh, nice. 
That's fair. Spawn the boss behind me. Completely silently, without a sound. No way to know, possibly, that he's back there. What amazing boss design. Excitement. So much excitement. It's thrilling. Why can I lock on from that far away, but I couldn't lock on from closer in a different fight? Oh, that's nice. I can't actually take advantage of that attack. Oh, that's the grab, right? did that much damage my shield up. Oh, strafing is supposed to avoid that. Okay. The unavoidable attack. Guess I'll just shield it from now on. Oh. The third one's up and spawned behind me without making sound, and there's nothing I can do about it. Maybe I won't beat this game after all.
Man, am I bored. Shit's super fucking boring. No point in avoiding it. It's gonna hit me later while I'm trying to fight. Somehow that missed. Fight his aids. He's not even like anything to it. There's not like a fight going on. They just attack. Uh, it's not like patterns or, or really anything like that. And the other four or three guys can do whatever they want whenever to. And there's no way to know what they're doing because you can't hear them. They don't make any fucking sound. There's no warning. You have to be looking in every direction, but if you're looking unlocked, you can't hit them when you're unlocked. There's no way. Depth perception doesn't exist down there. How am I supposed to hit them when I'm not locked on? And looking at other ones. I can't even hardly hit them when I am locked on. still miss because of the depth of perception is fucked. Apparently they're like 20 feet away when I think they're right in front of me. People complain about Beta Chaos. I gotta say, I think this is worse. Bed of Chaos shouldn't kill you more than like three times, really. It can get its cheap kills on you, but that's really all it should get, and then you should be fine, but whatever. I am just amazed at how little criticism I hear about this game. Either a bunch of brain dead idiots just saying it's bad without any actual evidence, or it's people who just have a huge boner for this game and think it's the most perfect thing that's ever existed. There's no in between, so as far as I've seen, I've never seen anybody give a measured review of this. It's always just blind subjective hate or blind subjective love. It is good for its time. But I don't ever hear people say that. They say it's better than Elden Ring in Dark Souls 3.
Oh, uh, yeah, I mean, yeah, it is. It's purely nostalgia. But they won't admit that. They'll say that the game is better. They'll be like, oh, no, Ornstein and Smo is better than God's Can Duo. Because Ornstein and Smo, one of them will be passive. And though that's not true. Damn it, I almost avoided them. Now well, there's three of them, so I'm fucked. There's nothing I can do now, it's over. It's like, uh, well, I'll say Ocarina of Time is the best Zelda game. And while that is heavily nostalgia, uh, I think that Ocarina of Time is a more solid game than this one. It has a lot of jankiness in it. Ocarina of Time does not. It's very, very smooth. Oh, fuck's sake. But at least I admit that Ocarina has faults and that I'm blinded by nostalgia. Dark Souls 1 fans are like so blinded by nostalgia that they can't even admit that it's nostalgia. Though I mean there's gotta be some people well, I don't know. Maybe the people who have played it afterwards wouldn't insist that it's the best. <clears throat> it is only nostalgia people who are insisting it's the best. Most of the reason why this stuff frustrates me so much is that not only will people say that DS1 is better than Elden Ring and stuff like that, but they'll say that the stuff that I'm running into, that I'm complaining about right now, isn't in the game. They complain about these problems in Elden... they'll say that these problems are in Elden Ring and Dark Souls 3, while acting as if those... the issues... there are no issues in Dark Souls 1. That's my biggest problem with it. As far as I can tell, a lot of the problems that people complain about being in Elden Ring and Dark Souls 3 are much more prevalent in this game and don't really even exist in those other games. I just don't run into the problems that people say they ran into in Dark Souls 3 and Elden Ring. I don't see many people say it's their least favorite. Maybe I'm just talking to the wrong people, I guess, but... Usually I see people say Dark Souls 1 is, be is the best. That is the most common answer I see. Oh 
shit, that was the grab. Fuck. Damn it, why did I roll? That was stupid. I guess so. I just wish they would admit it. Two of them attacking me. I'm out. Shit. Because their attacks are really hard for me to read, because they have these really long wind-ups, but then they swing the attack out instantaneously, so I don't know how to dodge them. Every time I roll, it's early. So they have really long delay attacks that apparently, that according to people I've talked to, only Margit is the first person to have delayed attacks in Souls games. And it's really bad when Margit does delayed attacks. But it's not bad when these guys do it, I guess, or any of the other bosses in this game that have really long delay attacks. It's just Margit. So I'm shielding. attacks can be dodged by strafing, except for like the spin slash. Like the diagonal ones can be dodged by strafing, the vertical can be dodged by strafing, the stab can be dodged by strafing. flasks down because the run back is pure cancer. Somehow no one, not a single person thought this was annoying. Japanese people are built different. How did that hit me?
How did I miss? Oh good, the other one's attacking me now. Great. And now there's three of them. This will be my last attempt. I need to eat and stuff. I'm not getting anywhere with this today anyways. Right off the edge. So I get fucking lose focus and start zoning out while running back. Shit puts me to sleep. Kill him, damn. It's really hoping that would fucking kill him. But I missed instead somehow. but still got me. Why couldn't I put up my shield? Got 
hit because I rolled like an idiot. Shit, now that one's attacking me. This coming at me, wonderful. How about you two leave me alone so I can fight the other one, huh? There's four of them still. Okay, never mind. Oh, there's five? No, there's only four. But they're all coming at me, so there's nothing I can do. Thing to do. Well, that's it. I'm done. That's enough for today. <sighs> Thanks for watching. Appreciate everyone who came by. And I'll catch you on the next stream of pain. Bye bye.